You guys become converted? Of course. Absolutely. <laughs> little by little. With this new program, dude, yeah. we got this. Something is changing. It's us. We're not just listening and learning. We're sharing, teaching, and acting. We are becoming converted. I think conversion is a... It's when you change your heart. I'm totally converted. I feel like I still have a lot more to grow, a lot more things I can do to improve, but I'm, I'm trying my best. As we become converted, our hearts are opened and our relationships with others change. As a group, we've just grown closer together and we've started relying on each other more, helping each other. Like I said um, earlier this week, we've been helping pull each other along. Well, we've always, we've always been really close, but we didn't really share our feelings with each other. We're not gonna sit down at night and say, how was your day? <laughs> <laughs> but we've like heard how we feel about things. And how the, the, how, how the spirit touches them. And yeah. it, we've become closer. Become closer. Well, it seems like that once you go through this program, your relationships with other people become better because you're always sharing your own experiences. You're always learning about other people. And in the same sense, you get a better relationship with your Savior because you learn to share with Him and you learn to, to receive His message for you. As we become converted, we realize what the gospel is doing for us and we want to share it with others. I think that makes it easier because you don't have to work as hard to always, you know, try to be thinking to have missionary experiences. You're already thinking about the gospel and your lesson next week or whatever. So it's already on your mind and it just comes up in regular conversation and you know what to say. You get that confidence uh, to not only share in class, but share outside class with others not of our faith. It's been able to give me that confidence that I need uh, to bear my testimony or to share the gospel uh, with those that don't have it. And as the Spirit works on our hearts, we want to use the atonement to become clean and worthy. Repentance is the best thing we have if used in the right way. We get interviews all the time with the bishop, and I'm very comfortable with him, and I'm very willing to tell him if something is going wrong that maybe I need fixed, or ask him questions when it comes to the atonement. And he's very willing to listen and answer and share his own experiences also. I wish everyone could just get rid of that fear of, oh, Bishop's gonna hate me, Bishop's gonna judge me. He doesn't judge you, he doesn't hate you, he's gonna love you. And I wish everyone could know, could see that. Go in there and take care of it because it's worth it. Filled with the love, peace, and forgiveness that come from the atonement, we become truly converted. Beloved youth, you will have your trials, your temptations through which you must pass, but there are great moments of eternity which lie ahead. You have our love and our confidence. We say to you, arise and shine forth and be a light unto the world, a standard to others.